All right, a quick video uh, response uh, reaction regarding the last couple of amazing atheist videos. Did a couple of these short videos. Maybe that's part of his new partnership plan. You know, he gets gets more views that way, uh, makes more money. Uh, but anyway, two of the stupidest videos. I mean, I think if any other atheist had made these videos, they'd be just laughed at. I mean, <laughs> you know, I mean, the intellectual character of them was so silly. And so he gets these huge ratings and fairly good views on them. And they're about absolutely nothing. I mean, just the silliest videos ever made, I think. <laughs> you know, from an atheist. From anybody. I mean, they're just dumb. Uh, so his first brilliant observation was that a judge in, I guess, his local area is running on the idea that he's going to be tough. Uh, you know, I mean, we all understand that. We all understand that concept. The law has all these ambiguities in it, and judges can make have discretion, and they can, uh, for example, go to all sorts of extremes in how they decide cases. And so, obviously, if you're selling yourself to a community of bastards who want to throw them in jail, well, then that's going to work for you, okay? And that's all it's going to be. It's a political formula. I mean, you know, you, you must understand politics by now. You can even see it in, like, the presidential campaign. They even, you even had a discussion about maybe Obama moving to the center, uh, you know. So I think you understand the concept, all right? It works as a marketing tool in the environment that judge exists in. And they do have discretion. Drudges aren't umpires. And it'd be very nice if that's the way the system works. But you're doing nothing to create a system where that would be the reality. So fucking shut up. Um, and so anyway, then the second video. Um, I even saw in N.D. Clark five-starred this one. Uh, because, uh, you know, the brilliant observation that, uh, you know, why aren't people upset about positive stereotypes? I mean, can there be a sillier statement? I mean, why aren't people upset when they're getting compliments versus, you know, that might be lies, uh, versus getting slandered, which might be lies? I mean, come on. <laughs> what a stupid pretext for a video. Um, and especially in the context, of course, he had to bring up the black thing and he has to bring up black penises and all this other bullshit. Um, and they're, why even use the word stereotypes? They're generalizations. Okay, most stereotypes are just generalizations. They are. They have an element of truth. Okay, but the very the whole point of what makes a generalization evil, you, this great defender of individual rights, is the idea that it destroys people's ability to be judged as individuals. That's the goddamn danger of it. I mean, you're, you're such, I mean, how can people buy into your duplicity? I mean, you, you sit there and present yourself as this goddamn advocate for the individual, and at the same time, you support and defend ideas that are completely the antithesis of that, where you would sit there and basically say, yes, let's write those stereotypes into social policy, and let's do it in some slimy, indirect way. I mean, it's disgusting. I mean, you would give pe people the power to stereotype people to prevent, to stop, the, to give them an excuse not to employ them, not to let sell them housing, not to let them live in a town, and then not to let them be served like any other human being in the town. I mean, it's just disgusting for you to make these videos and for you to bring up this black thing again. I just can't believe any black person who has subscribed to you has got to be a functional retard because you are an enemy to their fucking rights, their civil rights in this society. I mean, you overtly said it straight out of your fucking goddamn mouth that you don't think the Civil Rights Act was productive legislation, which is a ludicrous goddamn statement. And it's just disgusting that you get away with this bullshit. So anyway, that's, that's my reaction video to this moron community called YouTube. I mean, really, when somebody like N.D. Clark can't figure out he shouldn't be five-starring a video um, that is just idiotic. I mean, why do people not uh, be offended by positive stereotypes? I mean, conceptually, is there any, anybody stupid enough not to be able to answer that question? Oh, fuck. Well, anyway, <laughs> you people really do piss me off.